Good morning. Hope you're having a wonderful President's Day. Whatever that means anymore. You take the shine off of that title, huh? It's like any old bozo could be president, right? I digress. Hope you're having a wonderful day. I already said that, huh? My name is Bobby. I am the Emperor of the Universe. Yeah, tough gig, right? I've been thinking about that Emperor of the Universe title. I like it. The lady that I was getting my insurance from, when she was typing up my information, I guess that popped up. That, <coughs> excuse me, she liked my email, robinhoodiest1 at gmail. She thought that was cute. But yeah, she's like, she started laughing. I was like, what? She's like, oh, the, that just popped up. You're Emperor of the Universe. I'm like, yeah, it's a, it's just, you know, self love. How much do you love yourself? How, how, how much esteem do you hold yourself in? Right? So that's the way I looked at it. I'm going with that. I do want to talk about a few things real quick. Um, on my Got Happiness video, of course, I only get one person watching it, and the one person that watches is a total douchebag who attacks me and sends some cryptic, weird message about stealing my happiness and hope you enjoy your sadness or some bullshit. Oh, that's it. It's Corey. I was like, who the hell is Corey? You know what I mean? Unless it's Corey Hart. That son of a bitch. Oh, we could talk about Corey Hart. Yeah, that, yeah, you know the Canadian 80s one-hit wonder pop star? Mm-hmm. You know that whole look? That was mine. I met, I, I went up to Vancouver and I did an expedition and we were kids, right? And I saw him and we are hanging out. And I was on my jean jacket and my black rebounds and he was like, that's cool. And I actually gave him the rebounds. Next you know, he's got a song and he's wearing it out and I couldn't wear that jacket and I couldn't wear that ensemble for like decades. Bastard. Yeah, we had a falling out. That might have been Corey Hart. That's a bitch. Anyway, I digress. Luckily it was only one hit. Eh. Anyway. Love and light. Anyway, I want to talk about healing too. Because it's important to heal your, you know, inner child issues and traumas and our ancestral curses, you know, alcohol, uh, physical abuse, sexual abuse, you know, promiscuity, whatever. If we're always going to be fighting it. We're always going to be healing. It's not like one day you get a badge. You're here's your gold star. You're healed. You're always going to be healing from the wounds. It's like that Frodo. He's got that wound that's never really going to heal, right? I know I'm geek, but whatever. Lord of the Rings. Anyway, it's true. You know, you're always going to be healing the, the traumas, but you know, that's part of the win is actually not only knowing you're healing, and when you're in the process of healing, you, you glow up. It's just, you know, you, you don't do your old stuff no more. You don't, if you hang out with somebody that was doing bad habits, you don't, you just, you look at them like, really, you still doing that? That's kind of sad. Because it's not loving yourself anyway, that's for sure. When you do stupid shit, it's not loving yourself. But anyway, heavy traffic. So I'm going to let you go. I hope you have a wonderful day. I love you. God loves you. The universe is still digging in those pants, man. Rocking those pants, babe. Sassoons. Anyway, um, yeah, and Corey Hart, just back off, bucko. Why don't you go up there and protest with those truckers? Do something good. Stay away from my lugs. Bastard. Anyway, have a wonderful day. Namaste.